Welcome to Infigyan my dear friends. Today in this video we have one very interesting question from Math Olympiads. We are going to solve one absolute value equation. Now we have mod of x minus 2 times mod of x plus 3 times mod of x plus 6 equal to mod of x plus 1 times mod of x plus 4 times mod of x plus 9. So product of absolute value of functions on both the sides. So we know that product of absolute value of functions equal to the absolute value of the product of functions. Or I can write mod of a times mod of b times mod of c equal to mod of p times mod of q times mod of r. We can write mod of a b c equal to mod of p q r. Or we can write a, b, c. This would be equal to plus minus p, q, r. So we will solve only two equations from this absolute value equation challenge. So I will write LHS would be mod of x minus 2 times x plus 3 times x plus 6. This would be equal to mod of x plus 1 times x plus 4 times x plus 9. Now using this property, we will write x minus 2 times x plus 3 times x plus 6. This will be equal to plus minus x plus 1 times x plus 4 times x plus 9. So we have to solve only two equations, one with minus sign in the RHS and first one is with plus sign in the RHS. So I can write equation equal to our first equation equal to x minus 2 times x plus 3 times x plus 6 will be equal to plus sign x plus 1 times x plus 4 times x plus 9. Now we will multiply both sides. So we will multiply x plus 3 with x plus 6 in LHS first and then we will multiply x plus 4 bracket with x plus 9 bracket in RHS. So I can write x minus 2 in other bracket value will be x square plus 6x plus 3x 9x 3 times 6 18 will be equal to x plus 1. Here we will write x times x x square 9x plus 4x 13x 4 times 9 36. Again, we will multiply x minus 2 bracket with the quadratic bracket or expression. So we will get here x cube 9x square minus 2x square. So 7x square 18x minus 18x 0 minus 2 times 18 minus 36. In RHS, x times x square x cube, then 13x square plus x square 14x square. Then 36x and 13x. 36 plus 13 is 49x. And 1 times 36 is 36. Now easily we can cancel x cube from both the sides or subtract x cube from both the sides. We will get 7x square minus 36 equal to 14x square plus 49x plus 36. Now we are going to subtract 7x square minus 36 from both the sides. So I will write here minus 7x square plus 36. Here I will write minus 7x square and I will write plus 36. So LHS will become 0. In RHS 14 minus 7 is 7. So 7x square. Now 49x plus 36 
plus 36. So I will write 49x plus 72. So we have one quadratic equation in our case 1 or first case. 7x square plus 49x plus 72 equal to 0. Let us use quadratic formula to solve this quadratic equation. 49x plus 72 equal to 0. If I will compare with ax square plus bx plus c, I can write a will be 7, b will be 49, c is 72. And our quadratic formula is minus b plus minus a square root of b square minus 4ac over 2 times a. Let's plug in the values of a, b and c we will get minus 49 plus minus square root of 49 square minus 4 times 7 times 72. And denominator we are going to write 2 times 7 which is 14 equal to minus 49 plus minus square root of 49 square which is 2401 and product of 4 with 7 with 72 it is 2016 denominator is 14 now we will write minus 49 plus minus a square root of this difference is 385 over 14 so we are having two real values or real solutions for our equation. If I will write here x1 equal to, we will write minus 49 plus square root 385 over 14. This is our first solution. And second solution is x2 will be equal to minus 49 minus a square root of 385 over 14. So from first case or first equation, we are having two real solutions for our equation. Now we will consider our second case or second equation. Here we are multiplying these three functions with these three functions, but we have to put minus sign in RHS. So I will write x minus 2 times x plus 3 times x plus 6 equal to minus of x plus 1 times x plus 4 times x plus 9. Let's multiply. Result is already known. So we can write LHS directly. Value will be x cube plus 7x square minus 36 in the LHS and minus sign then we will write the same x cube then we will write plus 14x square plus 49x then we will write plus 36. Now we will take all the terms to one side and we have to multiply this minus sign into the bracket. So I can write our equation. Left hand side is x cube plus 7x square minus 36. RHS would be minus x cube minus 14x square minus 49x minus 36. Take all the terms to left hand side. So this time we will be getting 2x cube, x cube plus x cube. 7 plus 14 is 21, x square. Then we will write plus 49x. Then we will cancel minus 36, minus 36 or add 36 to both sides equal to 0. Now x is common from LHS. So I will write in the bracket 2x square plus 21x plus 49 equal to 0. Now we can apply product 0 rule. So we can write either x equal to 0 or 
2x square plus 21x plus 49 equal to 0. So here we have our third solution. So I will write x3 equal to 0. x1 and x2 was minus 49 plus minus square root 385 over 14. Now we have our third solution x3 equal to 0. The remaining two we can find out from here. So let us find the remaining two solutions. I will write 2x square plus 21x plus 49 equal to 0. Now I will split 21x. I will write 14x plus 7x. Addition will give us 21x. And if I will multiply both, I will get 98x square, which is matching as per our equation equal to 0. Now from first two terms, we can take 2x common out. So in the bracket, we'll get x plus 7. From last two terms, we can take 7 common. We'll get x plus 7 once again equal to 0. So we have factorization x plus 7 times 2x plus 7 equal to 0. Again, we will apply product 0 rule and we can write either x plus 7 equal to 0 or 2x plus 7 equal to 0. So from our first equation, we will get our fourth solution x equal to minus 7. And from our second equation, we will get our fifth solution minus 7 over 2. Now I will write our solutions from x1 to x5. So let me write x equal to 0 minus 7 over 2 minus 7 and then two irrational solutions minus 49 plus minus the square root of 385 over 14. So here we have all five solutions for our absolute value equation challenge. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.